Hey guys, it's Oceanx Productions here, back with another video. And uh, in today's video, um, I'm doing some voice narration on um, uh, my RFV2 gameplay. Now, this is a PvP analysis, and um, yeah, so this is just kind of showing um, how I usually play Project Berries and um, just kind of like uh, how. Um, I, I craft my armor. So here we go. Uh, here we go to craft the armor. And uh, if you wanna um, know, uh, just look at my the way I craft it. Um, this is something that I learned off my friend um, when he came to my house and showed me these servers. Um, he actually showed me this epic crafting way. So you guys should definitely use the, this that crafting way. So basically, um, in this game, I'm attempting to play some attacking. So what I do is I make a bucket and I fetch some water. Now, uh, I, what I was going to do there was going to make an infinite water source, but then I checked there and that was already infinite water source. So, yeah. And this is what you should never do. If someone has the high ground and is shooting at you like that, you never go and attack them. You never do it. Especially when I saw another guy coming around the other side. That didn't help either. So, here, here I die once. So, then I go back to respawn and repeat that process again. And now, uh, basically, um, it's very, very simple RFV to some games can be really quick and some can be really long. Now, I tend to uh, like to finish off maps really, really quickly. So, this is about fifth or sixth time I've won an RFV 2 map. So, yeah. So, same way I'm making the armor. Four at the top left. And I'm going to make my bucket first this time. Then, four at the top left. Four at the middle left. Two on the two bottom sides. And then, four, four. And then, the chest plate. And then, the two for the leggings. And all your other kind of accessories. So, now, I head back down. And I will go shortly go get a bucket of water from what I can remember. Because I recorded this about like, like five minutes ago. So, here you go. This time I collect my water. And now, uh, what I tend to do is uh, I, I like to be a rusher. Like, I consider myself an okay rusher. Like, I don't. So, here I see this guy here who's poisoned, I think. Because he's someone dying and I see his name. So, then I kill him. And uh, really what I should have done is I should have waited until my heart's regen, but yeah. Um, well, that's fine because I saw this guy here and um, he was kind of like, yeah. And um, I really should have, i tell you a better PvP skill than mine. Like I was just kind of hitting there. You need to hit and block, hit and block, hit and block um, like that. Because basically that you can deal damage to them and you can also... Uh, not not make so much damage for yourself so now i make it to the orange war room and i have a look around in it and i hear some arrows firing at me so when i went in there so i go grab a diamond chest plate and shortly i'll go grab the uh golden apples and then i'll go grab the uh pretty good bow i'll go grab the bow yep here you go and i replace it with my other bow and then I go up to pick up the orange wool. Now, uh, you always take two because um, you never know. Like, you might need one just like just in case if, like, you die. So then um, your teammate can kind of, before you, like, die, so your teammate can kind of, like, pick it up. And here I see here some arrows firing at me. And then I see, see a uh, blue guy. But then I see a couple more red guys. And I'm like, oh, jeez, I'm pretty safe. And then I see in chat, uh, someone from my team is supposed to lion wool, and I'm like, because I've got the orange wool, so I'm like, success, win-win. So, I go and I quickly go scale up here, and I'm home free, home free, and then I see a blue guy, and then I see him getting attacked, and I see him die, and then I decide to go back into my spawn area, and uh, yeah, place the wool, and I see the lion wool there, and... I'm like, yeah, yeah, that's it. GG. So, guys, um, hope you have uh, enjoyed uh, this video. Um, until next time. Um, yeah, so, um, 
there's a lot of stuff going on here. Uh, pretty quick RF V2 game. And until next time, see you guys later.